I gotta say, though, if you haven't... If you haven't tried... Spending New Year's Eve locked in a small room talking to yourself, I highly recommend it. Honestly. I might do this every year. Hey there, you're live on KRCT and I'm not alone in the universe. Who's this? Hey, it's Gabe. It's everyone's favorite bartender. So, what are your resolutions and how many have you already broken? Yeah, um, I was actually hoping to get your take on one of them. Great. Let me throw in a song and then call you. No, no, I meant... I called the show so I could talk to the psychic. Oh. All right. What's on your mind? There's... Someone in my family who might be totally alone right now. I've been thinking of reaching out to her. The thing is, it's been seven years, and all that time I never got in touch. Why didn't you? <laughs> because I didn't have anything to offer her. That's been my excuse for ages. <sighs> no, look, the truth is I'm terrified of talking to her. I don't know what she's been through. I don't even know if she's okay. I'm freaking out that she hates me, and honestly, I bet I could handle that if I knew it was coming. So, I'm calling you to ask, what's gonna happen if I contact her? What's she gonna say? You know I'm not actually psychic, right? Shh, shh, don't ruin it. Okay, give me a second. Hmm. You might not like what I'm seeing. Really? What would be tough for Gabe? But in a good way. You give her a call. She's surprised but really glad to hear from you. You start catching up, and at first it's wonderful. But the more you hear about her life, and what she's been doing these past seven years, the guiltier you feel. You overdo it, making all kinds of promises and all kinds of plans. You know you're pressuring her to forgive you, but you can't help it. <sighs> yeah. But then... You remember what a psychic on the radio once told you. You can't make the guilt go away. Stop trying. So you focus on her needs instead of yours, and you quickly realize she doesn't give a crap about how you feel. She cares about what you do. You decide to step up and act like the big brother you should have been. You make sure talking to you is a good part of her day. You give her advice when she wants it, and shut up when she doesn't. You talk about her future, find a place for her in your life here, and one day, you look at her in her hiking boots and Colorado sweatshirt, <laughs> laughing at something you did, and you realize you completely forgot to feel guilty. Thanks. Thank you for calling. <laughs>